And we're back with the NA, Nokia N9 unboxing. Uh, after a little research in the manual, I found out how to turn the thing on. This uh, smaller silver key on the side, which I took to be a camera button, is actually the power button. So if you hold this down for a bit, a little white LED lights up at the bottom. Nokia logo appears dimly at first on the screen. The boot up process is, is fairly long. Um, longer, I think, than uh, with the Symbian N8. So the animation is getting a little more uh, interesting here with expanding concentric circles. I don't know if you can see those in the video. Uh, not really. Okay. A little Nokia introduction tune. And here we are on a check your settings screen. Okay. It says it's 2 a.m. in uh, Helsinki on uh, January 1st. And we're using uh, UK English and uh, so let's change all that stuff. Time, time zone is Okay, we're in USA here. Let's see. Four, five, six. Okay. Oh, they put San Francisco on here. Usually on phones, it's USA, GMT, minus eight, Los Angeles. They say uh, on, on the N9, it says Los Angeles, comma, San Francisco. Thank you, Nokia. And the time. Okay, that's not right. Let's go to 12 hour because we're Americans. There we go. Okay, we've got uh, the time is right, the date. Change the English to U.S. English. Well, that's interesting. Ah. Okay, and it automatically set the regional format to U.S. English as well. Guess we're all set there. So a quick tour. So everything is done with a swipe. There are no buttons on this phone. We have the three home screens. And that's the end of the tour. So here are all our apps. Um, first thing I need to do, I don't have a SIM in here. Let's see if I can create a a Wi-Fi connection here. Hmm. Oh, yeah, here we go.
like my secret key here. Okay, let's see if we can connect to my home Wi-Fi. Connected. Success. Open the browser. Select a search engine. And let's try going to web review. And there you see it, webreview.com. Nice, smooth scrolling. Everything's fit nicely to the screen, even the images. Very sweet, I've heard good things about the, uh, the browser. It's uh, WebKit based. It's uh, the latest version of WebKit. I believe it's WebKit 2.0 or WebKit 2.2. Anyway, I'm going to be covering the browser in depth on Rapid View over the next couple of weeks, along with the rest of the features of the N9. We'll see what kind of apps we can do and just give the camera a ring out and uh, generally try to discover as much as we can in the time we have available. Uh, the next task for me is to run over to the T-Mobile store and see if they can hook me up with a micro SIM. Uh, the N9, like the iPhone, uses a micro SIM and I don't have one. Uh, that's what this stuff on the top here is. The first one it says one push. Not the easiest thing to push. Opens up. And there's your micro USB port. And then this part slides over and pops out. And there you have it, the micro SIM slot. Okay, that's all for now.